Hi there. I hope everyone is doing great. Uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. Kindly like and subscribe if you are new. If you have any question or any ideas in mind, kindly sh share with me on the email that is in the description or you can uh, do comment on videos. Okay. In this tutorial, I'm going to explain how you can uh, convert your Microsoft Forms uh, response into PDF file. Let's say you have this simple form and whenever someone submit form you want to make pdf from it and send that pdf as an attachment okay uh, it's up to you how you want to use that pdf in this tutorial i'm going to explain how to generate that pdf okay uh, first step will be creating flow so this will be automatic live flow and let's name it form to pdf okay and from trigger you will choose this uh, I prefer using old designer, so I'm gonna switch to old designer, but you can use new designer, it's up to you. And okay, uh, this is the form uh, that I created, and another will be get response details to get form details. Okay. And then choose your form from here. And response ID. Yeah. Now, whenever form is submitted, I will get all the questions answered. So I am going to use compose. Uh, let's say name it PDF body. It's up to you if you want to name it or keep it as a compose. Uh, so I am going to use, let's say, uh, Question one. I'm gonna use this tag. This is uh, HTML tag for line break. I'm gonna copy paste same and then and copy paste same. Okay. So in this one, I'm gonna update it to question two and this one to question three okay uh, i will also select the dynamic content okay now i am gonna create file i'm using one drive for business you can use sharepoint uh, i need to select the folder where i want to create file and the name of file will be test dot html it's up to you if you want to name it differently but make sure it ends with html okay in the file content put the output then once html is created we want to convert it to pdf use convert file action then use this in the id put this id and then pdf okay now once pdf is created we want to create file again okay this time it will be PDF. So I'm going to save it into the same location. Uh, for name, you can use the convert file name uh, or you can name it differently. Like uh, let's say test out and make sure it ends with PDF for the file content, uh, put file content from convert file. Okay. Then, uh, Last step will be deleting the HTML file as we don't need it. So use delete file action and delete the HTML file. It will be create file action. Uh, for uh, for this, you can rename them. Uh, rename them like let's say I'm gonna name it create file HTML. Okay, and then I'm gonna rename this to convert file to pdf and i'm gonna rename this to create file pdf and this will be delete file html okay at the end we don't need html uh, we just needed it for converting it to pdf so i am gonna use this id from here and delete that file okay if we save it and i'm gonna put just same uh, 
आंसर वन आंसर टू आंसर थ्री ओके एंड आई मोना टेस्ट दिस बेस्ड ऑन मैनुअली ओके नाउ इट्स वेटिंग फॉर द फॉर्म टू बी सबमिटेड एंड इफ आई सबमिट दिस फॉर्म ओके वेन आई क्लिक सबमिट द फ्लो विल स्टार्ट रनिंग as you can see it's running and if i go into the folder for youtube i will see a html file and if i wait a little bit and refresh page it will have pdf file in it okay and if i refresh again html should be deleted now okay and if i open this it will look like this like this is just plain text files but you can modify them uh, i'm going to use chat gpt to generate more advanced uh, uh, pdf so uh, i am going to delete this file uh, you can stop it here if you want but this is uh, more information so i asked chat gpt to generate me html code for three questions answers and if i go in here and in here i am going to delete this and put this okay now in here i am going to put question 1 in here i am going to put question 2 and in here i am going to put question 3 okay now if i test it based on previous submission now it sh it should show me more like more beautiful uh, pdf file like you can customize pdf as much as you want it is using html so you can ask chat gpt to generate html or you can use any different way like you can customize it or view it online uh, before creating it uh, so it's uh, generating as you can see test pdf is out and if i open it it will be lot more beautiful compared to before one as you can see this is lot more cleaner uh, but you can further customize it it's up to you like how you want to show it so this was the simple tutorial for converting microsoft forms into pdf now you can also send this pdf directly uh, to like instead of saving it let's say instead of creating file what you can do is you can use send email action okay you can use send email action and in here you can put attachment like uh, form form response dot pdf and in content you can put this file content for arm convert file okay then in this way you don't need to use this create file you can delete it if you want okay this is how you can do it uh, in in case you have any questions or don't understand any part can you do let me know uh, i am most available and i i will reply to you as soon as possible thank you have a wonderful day ahead